Hi, it's Alaska Cranny. I'm in Utah and I went to an Ace Hardware store and I found two things that I thought would be very fun. One was a 72 inch long bungee cord, which I've never seen one so long in my life. And then I found a 7 mil plastic drop cloth that's 9 feet by 12 feet. And I thought, oh, I could have a lot of fun with this out in the yard. And so that's what I did. I came with my two items. I came outside. I found two trees. And I hooked the 72 inch bungee cord to the trees. And then if there's one thing you can always find in Utah, it's rocks. So I took my tarp and I draped it over the bungee cord. Then I made it so that a third of it is in the front, a third of it is in the back, and a third of it is the floor. Then I put rocks on either side to hold it back, and I put the two together and I put four rocks across the front. So if it was raining, I could get out of the weather. I'd never want to rely on a 7.7 mil tarp for survival, but if I had to, I could. So let me show you. This is nice and roomy. I can climb inside. I could lay down if I had to. I could even have my gear in here. The rain's going to fall down the front. And because I kept the bottom underneath, it's not going to get dripping onto the inside. Put the top one a little farther of downhill than this side, than the front. The bottom goes right behind it, and then the rocks hold it down. And these rocks hold it back. And if you got very active in here, you'd probably tear it all up. And if a big wind came, it would probably tear. But if you were careful and wasn't too bad, you could probably be safe in here for a while. Anyway, if you have only two things, you can make a shelter. So, look for the 72-inch bungee cord and a little tarp and go outside and make a shelter. So I want you to leave me a comment on how you would make a shelter if you only had a few things. And if you like my videos, I hope you'll subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel. Have a great day.